used the scap to shake the swan out of the tree. Upturned it here on the whiteboard and all the bees seem to be running in nicely. So presume that the queen's in the basket. Lots of them at the entrance to the basket there at the base with the nasinoff glands exposed, sending out the pheromones for the other bees to come. Let's see. Um, see lots of them here, there's just a small space under the basket and see the nasinoff glands exposed, just the white strip at the back and they're fanning out the from there to send the scent out into the into the air, which brings the rest of the bees down to join them in the scat. Uh, still some flying here, but uh, they will they will move down if the queen's here. Some some might gather and they might need shaking again, but. all pretty much moved off the grass now and on there. Wasn't sure whether to use the larger or the smaller skep that I have here. Well this one would have been more than ample but it still serves useful to have a second skep there so you, if the cluster's big that still gathers on where they came from you can reshake and throw them without disturbing um, the scap on the ground. There is still queen pheromone on the tree that where they settled, which brought them all in there in the first place. But some are still being drawn back there.